A 14-year-old played in an MLS game Wednesday night. Kevin Sullivan is barely older than Instagram. Hmm. Just one year older. I got ties older than this kid. Uh, but he suited up tonight for the Philadelphia Union in their match against the New England Revolution. The youngest player ever to take the pitch in MLS, breaking a 20-year-old record that had been held by Freddie Adu, who accomplished the feat for the D.C. United in 2004. Sullivan is from Norristown, Pennsylvania. He's an attacking player who will transfer to Manchester City when he turns 18. There he is, 14 years old. Kevin Sullivan coming off the bench, hoping to make his MLS debut. Heads to the warm-up area, and how about Ty Baribo, what Paco Panama is to Southeast D.C., Ty Baribo is to the Union. His you first, lost me, yeah, you lost me. His first career hat trick, Zubin, pay attention. Quinn Sullivan, that's Kevin's brother. He didn't start either, he substituted into the game. 84th minute, he scores, there's his brother with the big hug. All right, immediately after Sullivan's goal, Kevin subs Baribo, the dude who got the hat trick, and he makes history, youngest player, 14 years, 293 days, just edging a do by 13 days. And he has one chance here with the ball. Again, he's an attacking guy, he's a great playmaker, but he's thinking shot here with the left. That's the leg he prefers to strike. You're gonna hear a lot from this young man in the future. Kevin Sullivan, his team wins five to one. His brother scores. He does it in his debut, but he has plenty more moments to come. Runs it to his family in the stands to celebrate this great moment. Kevin Sullivan makes his MLS debut. And here he is from the eighth grade to the MLS. Kevin Sullivan joins us now. Kevin, I just want to get your initial reaction. You get called in by the coach, head in there. What was your stomach like? You know, no nerves at all. I'm just kidding. It was, it was pretty crazy. <laughs> um, I've always dreamed of this day. So uh, I'd be lying if I didn't say I was a little bit nervous or a lot of it. Um, definitely butterflies and, and that run to hear all the, all the fans cheering my name and and just screaming was 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 pretty surreal. And then, you know, again, you didn't get a, a lot of action in the game, but as you look around at these full-grown men and, and the adjustments you have to make as opposed to playing with your peers, what were some of the initial uh, feedback that you took in for yourself? Yeah, obviously, I mean, uh, I'm not as, as physical or as fast as them, so I knew I had to keep the ball moving and have my brother on the field alongside me was was pretty cool um he gave me some feedback after the game and also uh some things to prepare before while we were on the bench so you know i've played up my whole entire life uh two or two or three years um so i'm pretty used to it but it was it was definitely challenging and i knew to you got to be smart um when you're playing in front of these big guys what are your ultimate soccer dreams look i mean Winning, winning the World Cup with America, mm. uh, something that's never been done. And I know we, we get a bad rep, but I can promise you in these, these upcoming years, we're going to be doing something big. Mm. And then what's the plan for the rest of the year? You've talked to the organization. Uh, what are they mapping out for you? Um, I haven't really, haven't really talked about it with them yet. Uh, sort of just going along with, with the season. And I hope to be uh, getting consistent minutes with, with the first team and also um, – sometimes playing down with the second team because development is is really key in 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 soccer so yeah i mean i i want to become a consistent player very soon but i know uh jim will only give me those minutes if, if it's deserved is that your natural hair color kevin no no dark brown my mom does this for me shout out to her shout out mom uh, well, again, congratulations. You're a cool dude, great personality, lots of uh, electricity around you. It's going to be fun uh, tracking your future, Kevin. Thanks for joining us on SportsCenter. Thank you so much for having me.